Hey, welcome back to my channel. My name is Amanda Lopez. I'm a clean beauty advocate, mother of two, who loves to talk and learn all things health and wellness. And today I'm going to be talking about the benefits of castor oil packs and how to make and use this ancient oil that has been around for centuries and used in so many healing practices. It's so beneficial and amazing. You definitely need to hear about this and need to incorporate this into your life. So if this sounds interesting to you, then definitely keep on watching. If you like this video, then be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you like the vibe, be sure to subscribe and go ahead and go follow me on Instagram where I share more about clean beauty and healthy living and we can get to know each other more. And everything I talk about today is going to be on my blog post. I will be sharing scientific studies on there. I'll be deep diving a little bit more into the details of like how all these benefits work and it'll have a full list of the instructions on how to use a castor oil packs, where to purchase the things for them and all of that. So definitely check out my blog if you want any of those details comment down below with any questions and I will be more than happy to help you. Just as a little disclaimer, I wanted to say that this is not medical advice. I am not a doctor. I'm not a healthcare professional. This is just me sharing the benefits and the research behind an amazing ancient practice that I've used in my own healing journey. So definitely consult with your doctor or healthcare professional before incorporating any of these practices into your routine. First, let's just talk about what castor oil oil is. I always opt for organic castor oil. I love the Heritage Store brand. It's cold pressed. It's hexane free. It's in a glass bottle. I feel like those are all the check marks to look for when you're looking for castor oil. Castor oil is a very thick and sticky oil and it's full of essential fatty acids. It's derived from the castor oil bean and the actual bean itself is actually quite toxic, but the oil inside holds so many beneficial properties that have been used in ancient history by our ancestors, and it truly is amazing plant medicine. So castor oil actually contains a very unique compound called ricinoleic acid. I believe that's how you say it. It is 90% of the fatty acid makeup, and it is believed to be the reason for a lot of the benefits inside of the oil. Now, there are lots of different ways that people use castor oil internally and externally. They put it on their hair and lashes to help your hair grow. It can be used for like wound healing and for a moisturizer. Some people use it internally. There's so many uses of it, but I would definitely advise like to be careful if you're gonna use it internally, consult with a healthcare professional because it has a very strong laxative effect and it can come with some unpleasant side effects. So definitely be careful of that. Today, we're specifically going to be talking about the benefits of castor oil packs. So what a castor oil pack is, is it is when you apply warmed castor oil over an area of your body to promote healing. Specifically, I'm mostly going to be focusing on applying it to the liver because that is the most common way that people use castor oil packs. But it could also be applied, you know, over the ovaries, on the abdominals, to lymph nodes, the breasts, like there's so many areas that you can apply it, but definitely the liver is like the most popular when it comes to castor oil packs. So I'll show you how to make a pack, but first I want to go over some of the benefits of castor oil. So there's so many health benefits to castor oil, but I specifically want to focus on five of the top benefits that I personally really love about using castor oil packs but castor oil can be used to reduce inflammation and pain it can be used to improve digestion it can promote clear skin balance hormones help you relax increase the circulatory system it stimulates the liver and the lymphatic system so there's just so many great benefits to doing castor oil packs and the first one i want to emphasize is boosting the immune system when you do a castor oil pack it's going to stimulate your immune system by stimulating the lymphatic system. So if you don't know what the lymphatic system is, it is a body system that we have that helps to flush toxins and wastes out of our body. Our lymphatic system has lymph in it, which is a fluid that has white blood cells. And these white blood cells, they actually are there to fight off infections, cancer cells, and viruses. So a research study using a double blind test showed that the people in this study who had the castor oil packs applied to their bodies 
daily for it was like i think they did it for a minimum of two hours in the study their t cells were immediately increased for the next 24 hours so the t cells are like your cells that go and fight off all the bad guys they identify and kill the cancer cells viruses bacteria and infections and all of that so it helps to boost the immune system by doing that. Our lymphatic system doesn't actually move or pump on its own. It gets pumped through movement. You can use modalities like dry brushing and exercise and castor oil packs to get it moving, but it's such an important system to take care of and keep moving for your overall immune health. Okay, so the next benefit is liver support and detoxification. And this was one of the main reasons why I got into doing castor oil packs because I was trying to find ways to support and detox my liver with so many toxins in this world. And I was also at the time doing like parasite cleanses and heavy metal cleanses. And my liver just has a harder time processing toxins, which makes me, you know, feel fatigued and sick a lot of the time. So during my health journey, one thing that I really learned was that supporting your liver is so essential to health. Like, I just feel like no matter like how good I feel, no matter like how many years go by, I'm always going to be including liver support now into my life because I now see just how important that is because there's so many toxins in the world. Our liver filters those toxins and our liver can always use some extra support. And liver disease actually accounts for approximately 2 million deaths worldwide. So it's definitely an issue. But the amazing thing is, is that our liver is like one of the only visceral organs that can regenerate on its own. So it doesn't matter how bad you've been to your liver. If you start loving it now, it has the potential to heal and regenerate. So that's so amazing and even more of a reason to start taking care of your liver now. So studies show that... Castor oil is literally like an antitoxin and it works to draw out toxins. It has the ability to do that to your liver and help to stimulate the liver so that way it produces bile and does everything that it's supposed to do. All you literally do is you place the castor oil pack on your liver, which is right under your rib cage on your right side, right here. And you're just gonna put it all throughout this area and yeah, that's how it absorbs into the liver and really helps to detoxify and support your liver. Okay, honestly, I don't know why I'm holding this up. I don't think I should hold this up through the whole video. Like my hand is starting to hurt. <laughs> but anyways, I'm gonna set this down for now. And I'm gonna talk about digestion. Castor oil packs can also help to improve your digestions. When you stimulate the liver, it's going to produce bile. That bile flows to your gallbladder and then your gallbladder stores that bile. And then when you eat food, it uses that bile to help digest the food. So it's gonna help your digestion. And you can also place it over your abdomen to reduce inflammation and pain in your abdomen. And research also shows that it can actually help relieve constipation as well. So sounds like a miracle to me. Those who have digestive issues to definitely consider doing a castor oil pack. And you could, I like to place the, the whole pack like, yeah, I start it at my rib cage, but then I also, I have like a big one, so I place it on my um, stomach too. So that way it just kind of gets the whole benefit, kind of sits over my ovaries as well and just benefits the whole entire area. Okay, so the next benefit of castor oil packs is that it reduces pain and inflammation. The compounds inside of castor oil are shown to actually reduce pain from neurogenic inflammation. That's why many people actually apply castor oil packs to injuries or places where they have pain and discomfort. So you could put it over like, you know, if you have a hurt back or hurt shoulder, you could do a castor oil pack over that and it's gonna help reduce the inflammation and the pain. And then the last benefit that I'm going to mention is promoting clear skin. You guys know I am a clean beauty fanatic and I know that skin starts from within. So I know I, I am a skincare junkie and I'm always promoting so many amazing skincare products and recommending them to friends and family. But I also always tell people, especially those that have eczema, rosacea, acne, that the skin starts from within. Look at your diet. Usually the skin is like a reflection of what's going on in our body. So it's another one of the ways that we detox. So if you have inflamed skin or any type of skin condition, it typically can be a root cause of poor digestion, 
poor liver support, hormonal imbalance. So castor oil packs help with all three of those, which in turn promotes clear, radiant skin. And I definitely noticed after doing castor oil packs that my skin was looking clearer even just the next day. If that is not enough to get you to go into a castor oil pack, then I don't know what is. Now, I'm sure there are, and I know there are, lots more amazing benefits of castor oil, but I really wanna get into how to actually do this thing. And I love that it's actually super affordable and like a realistic thing that we can do. I mean, I'm honestly a victim myself of like not doing it just because I'm like being lazy, but I really, especially after this video, I'm like, okay, girl, you really need to start doing your castor oil packs more because it's so beneficial. And I think that it'll be really helpful for my health. So I definitely want to also, you know, start being more consistent with it. So you can actually do a castor oil pack like every single day if you wanted to, but I would suggest starting off slow because it is detoxifying your body and that could pull out some toxins that might not make you feel very well. You wanna make sure that you are flushing out those, tox those toxins with hydration, drinking plenty of fluids, making sure that you are having a bowel movement every day to really help and flush out whatever toxins the castor oil gets going through your liver. So I recommend starting off slow, maybe a couple days a week for like 15 to 20 minutes. And then over time, you could work your way up if you wanna do it more days a week, if you wanna do it in one hour, two hours, some people sleep with it on, like that's totally up to you. But I say move slow and pay attention to your body and how your body feels. Now let's get into the actual castor oil pack itself and how to do it. First, you're gonna want to get yourself some good quality castor oil. Like I said in the beginning of this video, I recommend organic, cold pressed, and hexane free, and in a glass bottle as well, because since castor oil pulls impurities out, if you're putting it inside a plastic, it's probably gonna pull out the chemicals in that plastic, you know? So you don't wanna be putting that into your body. So this is the one that I use. There may be other good ones, but I do recommend this one, and I'll link it down below. And then you're going to need a flannel or wool cloth it could be cotton as well i recommend that it be unbleached dye free organic if possible because like i mentioned the castor oil is just going to pull any chemicals so you want it to be just very natural and not anything added to it so i bought this one on amazon as well i'll link to it and this one's perfect for holding the castor oil you're gonna probably want a container like this to put the flannel in when you do the castor oil. And then you're going to need a heating pad or a like hot water bottle and an old towel that you don't mind staining or getting dirty. Just a disclaimer, castor oil does stain, it is sticky. Like you wanna make sure that you're not wearing important clothes. You probably wanna lay a sheet down on your bed or like a towel or something that you don't mind staining because it will soil it and stain it and it's also like very sticky as well so you definitely don't want to get that on anything that's important to you so all you do is you place your cloth in here and then you're just going to pour a couple tablespoons of the castor oil over the cloth and you're gonna wanna let it absorb. So you don't want it like soaking, but you want it kind of saturated. You may have to do it a little bit at a time. When you have a brand new cloth, you may wanna do it like earlier in the day or a couple hours before, so it has time to like soak in. But if you don't have that time, don't worry, it'll still be beneficial. But you could reuse this cloth like, I don't know, up to 40 times or something like that. I just keep mine in this container. I put a lid on it and I actually just like put it in my fridge to just like preserve it so the castor oil doesn't go rancid or anything. And then every time you use it, you only have to add just like another tablespoon or two of castor oil to your cloth. Then you're going to take that saturated cloth and you're going to place it over the area that you want to apply the castor oil pack. So like I mentioned before, I like to focus on the liver. So I kind of place mine like here, which is underneath my rib cage on the right side. That's where your liver is. And then I also will place it like all the way on my abdomen and like my ovaries. So I kind of like just do the whole thing. And then over that, you want to put like a towel so you don't stain your heating pad. So I'll just put a towel right over that. And then on top of that, you just put your heat. So a heating pad or a heated water bottle. 
and then you just relax like I said start out for like 20 minutes you know you could watch a whole movie and just have it on like I recommend doing it like at night because it promotes restful sleep and it makes you just like it's really relaxing and I also recommend staying hydrated so you can drink tea or water or some kind of nourishing liquid while you're doing it and then yeah you pretty much just chill out so it's not that hard when you're done you are going to have sticky residue on your stomach so you know you're just going to want to use like a little bit of soap or something to and a cloth to like wash off your stomach and then you're good to go put the cloth back into the container and use it for next time but pretty simple right it's a pretty simple practice for such amazing benefits. I definitely think it's worth it. I think that more people should be incorporating this into the routine. I did want to say that if you are pregnant or if you are currently menstruating, it is not recommended to do a castor oil pack. So skip it during your menstruation. And then, like I said, if you're pregnant, definitely skip it. If you're trying to get pregnant, it would be a good time to be doing it to help flush out toxins, to aid in your fertility. But once you've are pregnant then or suspect you're pregnant then I would stop doing it because you don't want to be doing anything like that when you're pregnant. I really hope that this was helpful. Like I said before, put any questions down below and head to my blog if you want to see more on the research and the details or if you want like the comprehensive steps on how I do my castor oil packs. I'll link all the things down below that you need to do your castor oil pack. And if you like this video, then be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you like the vibe, be sure to subscribe and I will see you in my next video.